Tonight at 530, a 1974 Volkswagen Super Beetle is no longer on the market. It is also nowhere to be found. It was stolen right from the owner's shop, and police are now trying to track down the criminals who took it. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Carolina Cruz spoke with the owner, who says this is a first. Stepping into Cardone and Daughter Automotive is taking a trip to the past. It's like working in a museum. People trust David with their most valuable treasures. They're worked on, then stowed away every night. The layout of cars every day is different because they come in and out of the shop sort of differently. So to spot a car that might be out of position is unique. He can't complain. 25 years, 45,000 cars serviced, only one bizarre experience. And in that time, the only thing ever stolen was a set of hubcaps by an angry wife at an ex-husband. Actually, make that two incidents, counting one this week. We've never lost a set of keys in 25 years. But now we've lost my car. <laughs> lost is a nice way of saying it. It was stolen. What these criminals didn't know is David has security. Lots of it. 16 cameras in all, including this one. It captured the moment they took off with his car. Police are searching for these suspects. The irony of it all? That the car they stole is actually my car. <laughs> and it's emblazoned with a large Cardone and Daughter Automotive sign on it with our phone number and our website, www.cardoneanddaughter.com. It doesn't make any sense to David. And it's a really unsettling feeling when something personal is taken or even something material that's part of you or your business and or your home or any of that stuff. He's now out of a car, out of the money he was going to make from selling it and lost his sense of peace. In Old Saybrook, Carolina Cruz, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.